back. Let's also bring back Samika Knight, anchor at KTRK, our local affiliate in Houston. Hi. So you're Houston Hi, native. Guys. What do you love most about Houston? What's on the top of your list? Oh, thank you so much for asking about Houston and the helicopter above. Um, I love everything about Houston. So, and I know it sounds cliche, but the Houston hospitality, I mean, everywhere you look, there's a smile. Hey, how are you doing? There's a hug, the embrace. And uh, you know what else I love about Houston though, Kelly and Ryan? We say y'all down here. I don't know if you guys say you all, but we say y'all. Y'all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, y'all. Mm -hmm. That is I true. Like that is a, that's, it makes sense. And it's so funny, like, if, if we hang out with somebody, like, from down south, within three seconds, we start y'all in. Y'all, no yeah. It also saves me a yes. lot of time when I'm typing text to Kelly just to put y'all instead of yeah. you all. That's right. Just, just, just add the, just add the y'all. And by the way, do you guys, have you ever heard about uh, Tex-Mex? Because yes. if, if, if you talk about Houston, you got to talk about the food. No, Tex I don't want to put you on the spot because there are, I'm sure, a lot of competitors there. What's the best Tex-Mex restaurant in your that opinion? You, that you're a favorite. Ooh. Ooh. Mm, mm, mm. Sorry, I had a food moment right there. Uh, <laughs> you know, you are putting me on the spot, but I have to say, Ninfa's near downtown Houston, near a ballpark, near Minute Maid Park, go Astros. Uh, yeah, so uh, we're talking about fajitas, we're talking about nachos. I'm talking about the nachos, you know, with the, the beans and yes, the, the, the fajita meat and mm, the pico the de gallo. Mm, mm. Oh. Sizzling. Yes. Yes. Love. yes. Love. I, yes. I can't think about anything mm. else. Oh, gosh. Mm, we're yeah. so, we are, you know, we're so, <laughs> we're so hungry. We are so hungry right now, even though uh, I just had a shrimp and I'm like... You had my, a shrimp. That I opened up the hunger. And now my hunger door Once. has been opened. You know what I mean? Shmigo, what are some of your favorite activities there in Houston? OMG. Okay, so I love music and I love the arts. Um, and so, I mean, anywhere you go, you'll see live music, quartet, a, a jazz band, or whatever at brunch. So staying with the arts, we have what's called the Miller Outdoor Theater. It's a theater that's outdoors, so and it's nice. huge. The stage is amazing. Listen, and I mean, you can bring, you know, a blanket and have a picnic or bring your boo. You know, all of that. <laughs> but also with Miller Outdoor Theater, <laughs> with Miller Outdoor Theater, we have a huge hill. And it's incredible. It's for the kid at heart. You can roll down the hill. I mean, my parents, their first day was rolling down the hill. I'm like, that's not that cute or romantic, but it's incredible. Yeah. <laughs> Hannah told us that you rolled down the hill, that it really is like it's that much fun that you've, ro you've rolled down the hill. Oh, I'm always rolling. You can drive by Miller Outdoor Theater, I mean, every day around noon, and you'll find me rolling down. I mean, my eyelashes come off and everything with it, but, you know, I am rolling down the hill. Well, thank you, Samika, for your hospitality this morning You're in great, Houston. Great, great, great to guide. see you. Great tour guide. We appreciate it. We'll see you it. soon. <laughs> Thanks, guys.